Let's animate a company logo. Let's pick one out. I have a bunch of logos here I have made. I have, now remember we have to work with SVG files. Let's take this one. This one is kind of fun. This is Better Homes and Gardens. And I have two images here. You know what I'll do? I'll make them bigger on the stage. All right. And then I'll move the layers, I'll move the, uh, Grab that little piece there and put that right over here. How about that? All right, so there we have a logo. Now we want to apply a little bit of action. Let's do a brand new animation. Well, we have two elements that we can see here. We can also see over here on the left that we have two graphics. So the first graphic we want to play with here and move is the Better Homes and Gardens. And we're going to bring that in, see here the in animations, I'm going to bring that in from the left. I'm going to overshoot it from the left, see that? And then I'm going to take that other little piece, the blades of grass, and I'm going to spiral that in. I'm going to spiral that in coming from the left. So let's see how that looks, all right. We have a pause animation. Now let's take a look at the pause animation. And let's take a look over here. It says apply changes to state or selected. If you apply an animation to state, then you will be applying the animation to, the, to both images. You see that if I apply a bounce in state, then both of them will do that. If I apply that a sway, they both sway. I'm going to pick select it because I want to do something a little different. So first I'll take a look at Better Homes and Gardens text. And what I want to do with that is I don't want it to do anything. I want it to be still. I want it to be static. And then I want to take this little blade of grass here and I want it to do a slow rotation counterclockwise, I like the counterclockwise, you can choose clockwise or counterclockwise here, see, maybe clockwise, okay. So we have a clockwise rotation and it will do that for four seconds. For this particular animation, I don't really think we need an out, so I'm not even going to create an out animation uh, because I like this. And if you create a GIF file for this particular one, it will loop and it will just move around and around. It will just go around in a circle. And I think that's a really nice solution for this kind of a uh, corporate logo. And there's Better Homes and Gardens.